You like it? <laughs> Hi guys, a uh, very warm welcome. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Can you stop repeating after myself, Howard? Can I please script the people in a proper way without you bothering mommy? Okay? Thank you. Okay, guys, uh, today is the day before Valentine's Day. Um, I have few things to go and get quick. I have baked last night cakes and then I have baked the cupcakes now. It is to nine and I just finished the cupcakes. I'm going to town quickly to Plastilon to go find few boxes and insets and stuff. And then maybe strawberries. I'm stressing guys for strawberries. I'm stressing. I could not find any strawberries in Ochivarango. So I ordered strawberries from food lovers on Saturday. Guys, I paid $299 for five packets of strawberries. And a friend of mine brought them for me. Mind you, I was not in town. I was out that Saturday. So when she brought the things, my little sister was home and she took, got, took the things for me. But I'm not saying that it's my friend's fault because it is really not. Because when I called food lovers, they reserved the strawberries out for us. So I don't know in which condition. Maybe they already packed it up for her just so she can come pick it up, pick and pick it up. So guys, long story short, yesterday I woke up so I can wash out the strawberries, dry them out, and start the process for Valentine's. You guys, only three individual strawberries out of five packets. Not three packets. Three individual strawberries out of the five packets of strawberries are fine. So I also don't consider them fine because they have been with the rotten ones. I was shocked and I was like, Maybe let me try and rinse because I could see these white, foamy, cottonish things on it. So I use baking soda and vinegar to rinse them with. Guys, the things are so key. Like, pop, 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 pop. I, they, I cannot do anything with them. And they don't even have taste because I tasted one. I taste test one. It does not have the sourness. It does not have the sweetness. It's kapu. I don't know how to explain that kapu in English, but yeah. So then I called them and I told them that I'm experiencing this. And then the lady that helped us on that Saturday was off or is off. And um, the manager actually told me that I can keep the receipt and keep the strawberries and bring it back whenever we're going to go back to Ventuk one day. Just freeze them, throw them in the freezer because they need proof. So I did that and now I'm stressing because no shop in Ochivarango has a single strawberry. But I'm going to try and run around again and see. Hopefully I'm starting from the location safe more. Hopefully there isn't people so much over strawberries there and they could be in stock. So I'm going to run there. Vurman broke from there. I'll go to spa again because yesterday they told me they may get it today. So I'm going to make it turn there again. And um, yeah, from there, I'm going to gather a few little things. I'm going to return Howard's two shorties that the papa bought for. He was with the kids on Saturday. They went together to town nicely because I was not here. And they he bought two shorties for the child for about 159 Like one shorty was 79 And the things don't even look like they are worth the price. Like they're not even branded stuff. So I feel like I'm going to return them and take something else instead. My excuse will be that they don't fit. And I'm going to get smaller sizes. <laughs> yeah, so I'm going to see that and also find for Hazel a, a Valentine's dress for tomorrow because she's got to wear Valentine's tomorrow apparently. So yeah, and then see you guys in the bit. Okay? I talk too much. I really talk too much, guys. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I'm with a buggy today, a gigantic buggy. It's a manual transition. I love manual. I love to change my gears. I am old school like that. I'm old school like that. I'm very much old school like that. So I love to change gears. The cars we get to drive are just manual. 
but they make only automatic cars lately so it is what it is we're gonna roll with whatever we get but i love my automatic car manual cars i love my gears so guys see you guys in a bit and yeah say bye guys bye so see you guys see you guys love you love you <laughs> We here at Spa looking for it with Howard. <laughs> hey, Dada. You can see the whole Valentine's. See the whole Valentine's. Thank God, they here. Got them in stock. Guys, you have no idea how happy I am. <laughs> I something just told me i told myself i was gonna go to spa a uh, safe more in the location and then search every shop individually until i get to spa some i don't know how i end up at spa and I, I just happened to find them boom so i bought the whole bag of it and i know i'm not gonna shot hopefully fingers crossed because this should be an expensive you guys strawberries are expensive so we are headed to Plastilon and I'm gonna buy a few boxes and chocolates there. Uh, boxes and chocolates there and then, yeah. From there, see you in a while. Come, come, Baba. Come stand here, please. Can you stand behind that auntie? Mommy coming up. My dear. There is nothing Valentine's here. I'm I'm coming. I'm coming, Papa. Uh uh. Um guys, I went to uh what is it? I went to Plastilon and I found pretty much everything I needed. I will show you guys what i bought and then i went to pep and i bought not bought i was exchanging two shorties that the papa bought for howard on saturday that was not really i won't say it's not a good looking it's not that they were not good looking it's just that <laughs> that man doesn't know how to choose things nice but he knows how to choose for me nice things <laughs> hey hey knock it off so i told myself i'm gonna retain them luckily he bought a bigger size luckily he bought two to three years old shorties for howard and you know guys that on my son as a shorty is super big <coughs> so i was meaning to go exchange them already to like get a smaller size for howard but then i just felt like the shorties that he got for that price Mm -mm. he could have done better but i told him that i'm going to exchange it and he's like oh no it's fine it's not that like he also really meant to go buy him shorties it just happened that they were there and he saw the shorties and he just wanted to get them not that i'm against what he wants to buy for the kids no it's not bad i was just feeling like <clears throat> I was just feeling like um, I could get I could get better shorties. Why should I go for a seventy nine dollar shorty that is not cute if I can get a sixty dollar decent shorty like a cine shorty that he can go to town with around and stuff like that? So I just I just took those ones. I went to exchange and I got two other shorties and also a vest out of that money. Can you believe that? Yes without even paying us and i paid like three dollars something on it yeah i paid three dollars something on it that's it now i'm looking for my daughter an outfit for valentine's the traffic everywhere guys i'm trying to record and create content for you guys but whenever i just lift up my hand and this car's windows are not tinted that much to protect me from the outsiders so I'm trying to get for Hazel and Valentine's outfit. 
guys she has already clothes that i believe she could just like improvise and wear but she told me she wants red and guys if i can buy for my daughter or things for my child why not if i can because that child works so goddamn hard for her age so i just feel like i can do what i what she needs or what she wants like if i can why not that's my mentality it's not that i'm trying to spoil her i don't i hardly spoil my kid you guys i'm not that mom i'm a strict as a mom yes she gets away with anything she wants with the father but not with me but i have also realized that she is such a hard-working seven year old that if she needs something i can't keep saying no 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 yes there are things i give her and there are things that i also like say no to but yeah she wants red and white i couldn't find anything in town guys i was in pep i was in ackermans in ackermans i got a red legging so i bought for her legging and i'm hoping that legging is also gonna fit and now i'm looking for a white top or a yeah something to put on top because the legging is red so we are looking for a red but red top or a red red or white top yeah so i'm hoping i'm driving i'm on my way to the safe mall in the gassy in the location there is this um how do they call it there is the step in the location and it always tends to have a lot of nice things than of pep in town because everybody's in town so people always tend to buy out from the town one so when you come to this one in the location you somehow get to have beautiful nice things that are left off here because not everybody shops here because it's in the location i believe so yeah i'm going to check there and from there i'm gonna head back home and start my baking things like i'm gonna start with the um yeah see you guys in a bit are you falling off <laughs> hi guys my son he was not holding on and i just took off sorry sorry baba okay no guys nothing absolutely nothing there was nothing <laughs> So um, I'm gonna pick her up at one anyways, and it's 10 o'clock now, like just a little past 10. So when I go pick her up, I will take her to Master Price because I didn't get into Master Price. So then I'll go make the 10 in Master Price and see if we can find a white top. If not, then we're just going to wear anything from home uh, if we don't find a red top or a white top in mr price she's just gonna wear anything from home yeah so let me go home for now and go do my strawberries and then go check in the afternoon guys it, i just came with this tin just to find out that this whole road is closed now the hell am i gonna drive from here they were supposed to tell me. Uh, give signs. Oh, gosh. My goodness. So I have to drive all the way into the location and then back to my house. <laughs> Yo. Okay. It is what it is. Yeah. So I went ahead and I got this. What is this? What do they call it? It's actually a decorative thing. Wood wool. Did I say it right? Wood wool. Yeah, it's wood wool. I got this big one. I'm sure, pretty sure that is enough. And then I got this box for the chocolate um, smash thing. I only have one order for that one. So I did not feel the need to buy the other type. I just had to buy one of this. And it's too high, but I'm going to cut it open in half and make it short and improvise. I mean, I'm going to see what I'll do with that one and then <clears throat> i bought the you guys know now that we don't buy cupcake boxes individually at uh plastilon anymore like i said in the other video we buy in bulk so i already have more of this from my previous order i have the insets i am gonna use those boxes for the strawberry chocolate coated strawberries so i will be using that for that so i bought two boxes of this of the cupcakes two of them 
because some are going to the strawberries like i said and some will be having the cupcakes and then i only bought two pizza boxes <coughs> the two pizza boxes are basically for the two cakes that i baked let me show you guys the box it is for this chocolate cakes one is chocolate and one is um what is it uh red velvet so i have baked these cakes so i'm gonna insert them in this box just because i didn't want to have them outside on the cake board and they have cake boxes as well but it's massive it's super huge than this pizza box as well so i was like no the cakes are very small it's a mini cake it doesn't have to be that big so i got that and like i said i i got the strawberries in spa finally and then i bought myself two two cages i could say two cages oops my strawberries are falling apart here oh boy i'm just happy that i found strawberries i'm just super happy yeah like i said it's a one kg it was on special for one kg normally a 500 gram is 90 dollars plus minus the 500 gram but then they had special for one kg is 430 i believe let me see yeah one was 128 so when i bought one here for that 128 i felt like i might need again and run back so i just had to buy two so i don't run out of it because chocolate coating takes really a lot of chocolate Hey, Papa. Butterfly. You're mushing the water. Yes. See, guys, why I don't buy toys for these kids? He just bought that thing and he threw out all the soap water out of it. It's like uh, you blow bubbles out of it. That's why I don't buy toys. Yeah. This is a ribbon I bought at China Shop. $59 a ribbon. So I can just have them around the uh boxes that is if i really have enough time to still do and yeah i went to exchange how it yeah let me show you guys on saturday they were massive and ugly <laughs> sorry to say that papa but they were really ugly then i went ahead and got this cute two shorties and it was 60 dollars so i got two of this and then with the change i got this one and i just uh, the shirt like a vest and I just add like three dollars or four dollars onto it, and then that's it. This is the lacking I'm talking about for Hazel. Because it's Hazel's lacking. I hope and believe it's gonna fit. I just need to find her a top. I also found this at China Shop, and I just felt the need to take it so she can have something around her hair. Because her hair is in fishtail, and you know, there isn't any other styles I can do at this point. So yeah, that's it guys. Let me start washing my strawberries and have them dry out. And then in the meantime, I can start with the cake sickles. Look, she's there. I saw her standing there. She she's coming. She saw us. Come here. It's a struggle here. Getting kids at the school. Mommy, the car. Mama's going to Elsa. Hey, Nathan. Did you come at all? <laughs> to the people we're vlogging. Okay, let's leave before the traffic gets hectic. So guys, Hazel is going to swim. <laughs> we are on our way to her swimming classes. I think you guys have seen like in the previous few videos that she has swimming classes. See, guys, I have my work to do, yet I have kids and people to cater to. My life is not just my life. So I left my cake boxes just like as is. And then I have to take this woman away. Luckily Howard is sleeping and OC is at home. So he's going to be with OC. 
and then yeah so what are you gonna stream today can you update the people tell the people how how I, much have you done gases now how good are you in your swimming now i think i'm a bit good let me close the window because they can't hear you you said I, what i think i'm good in it you're good in it yeah but the water is warm actually no they know about that how good are you in the water now like how good is your swimming how is your swimming improving how feels, how good are you getting it feels comfortable and I love to pedal, pedal, and kick and pedal, and it's good. It's really nice. That's what I like about it. Okay, if you say so. Mm. Okay, we are late to come. Ja, vooral van mijn kind wat nou hierdie extra goed vlug. <laughs> So this is how I have been busy taping these things. I think I did not even do this one straight and slick. Let me just really do that on nice. So this is how I've been doing the boxes. Like I've been cutting out to make windows because these boxes did not come with box uh, with windows, and there is nothing like so. You see like this i've also cut out i still need to put on the window there here this one's i'm done i'm done with all of those so i still just have few more these are for strawberries that i'm busy with and then this one's for the chocolate box and yeah oh guys Ooh, the level of my tiredness ne? they say don't be careful what you wish for and be careful of what you say and be careful of what you speak into existence like but yeah i am out i am tired but my sister is still here helping me out <laughs> she doesn't like to be recorded guys but yeah i'm done no i'm not done i'm very far from done um we have done the cakesicles successfully done the geometrical chocolate hearts done um what else did it strawberries chocolate coated strawberries we're just gonna do the decorations those spikes and then we're done with those ones and from there i have butter here that i'm gonna beat for the icing sugar for the cakes and the cupcakes so then i will be done right that's basically it yeah so if i don't record anymore throughout the night you guys then no i'm tired and i'm just rushing to finish because it's already nine o'clock in the night so let me go ahead and finish that 
so I can go sleep and then have enough energy for tomorrow morning again because I still have to um, decorate and make the things look pretty. So guys, see you in a bit. Good morning, you guys. Very warm morning. I am still standing here since last... Oh, ah, who's that? Thank you, let's get camera here. I'm still standing here since last night. Okay, no. I went to bed. Slept around 11. Not 11, 12. Yeah. Slept around 12. And then woke up 6. I am already here. Doing the final touches. It is uh, 8.00. 40 yeah i believe it's 8 40 now and i have told people to come pick up their cupcakes and orders by 12 and i think i am a bit ahead of time today first time in my life which makes me feel good so but i think i will be done early and i might just as well call them as soon as i'm done because some people have to drop off at work some have to drop off at um, schools. So whenever we're ready, I don't think it's going to be an issue to let them know to come pick up. My sister is behind the camera, by the way, if you're wondering who's recording. <laughs> so, yeah. So this is the last box for cupcakes and uh, for the strawberries. And then I will start with the cupcakes the final coding and decorating of the cupcakes i have done the geometrical hat already it's done it's inserted in the fridge and now we're busy with the strawberries also done with the strawberries we are done with the cupcake sets as well we are done with the cupcake sets in we are moving on to the cakes. It's 12 boxes of cupcakes and we got how many boxes of strawberries and, and cookies. Yeah. Yeah. So cookie. cookies. Guys, you have no idea how stressed I am right now, but we are almost done. Not almost, we're done. We're just covering this up like so in a bow tie form to make it look cute it is 11 few minutes to 11 i would say right was it fun mm. yeah. yo guys oh my goodness look at how i look like i'm coated in icing sugar and chocolates and yo i need a bath i need a whole bath before i have to go get ready but yo guys i'm done Thanks to my little sister down there. She helped, she made it all possible. So um, let me show you guys a little things that we have done. It, it looks little, but it is a lot of work if you can really see. So I yeah. said I only have seven, there's seven, and then I have this ones are all cupcakes. And they look so beautiful, you guys. How should I show you? Because I have a bow tie here where they... Um, yes. See, guys? That cakesy girl has the lap on. And then this cakesy girl is just plain like that with sprinkles on. All the other four are cupcakes. Two chocolates and two red velvets. And, yeah, that's how they look. And then two cakes that the two clients ordered. And then the smash hammer. And she said she wants it in blue. That's why I made that one blue because I think her happy likes it in blue. So guys, uh, that is it about today. I will be handing it all out and then I'm going to take a shower. Come on, it's Valentine's Day. But I'm going to take a shower, refresh, fit this little one. And we're also going to go ahead and have something to eat or eat out. I don't know. I'm so tired. So guys, if you like this video, give big thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on your notifications and you'll be notified whenever I post a new video. See you guys in the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>